down with OPP. Now for the ladies. OPP means something gifted. The first letters are the same, but the last one's something different. It's the longest, loveliest, lean, I call it the leanest. Now, lady, here comes a kiss. Blow a kiss back to me. Are you down with OPP? Well, you know me. Even if most men are as shallow and self-absorbed as my Homer. Hey. Season's greetings. Jeez, Marge. Homer Simpson here, and if you believe in peace on Earth and goodwill towards men, then you're living in a dream world with fairies and pixies and ice cream mountains and hot fudge rivers. Wait till the end of the month when your credit card bill gets here. <laughs> Hang on just a second, hang on just a second. Let me get the phone here. Oh. <clears throat> Rock 107. Yes? Is, is that the way you answer the telephone? Well. What if I was somebody from corporate calling? Well, I... What if I were the big cheese calling? Well, I'm sure we'd all be very happy for you, sir. <laughs> I'm serious, Carl. I know. I want to hear a proper greeting each and every time you enter this phone. All right. Whether it be the request line or the business line or this hotline. Yeah. I want to hear a nice chipper holiday greeting. I'm sorry. Something like, hello and happy holidays. <laughs> Thank you for calling Central New York's only hit music station. Yes. Rock 106. May I be of assistance to you at this time? Jeez. And might I suggest a tip on how to relieve some of your holiday stress? <laughs> Morning. How are you? I'm doing good. <laughs> how are you doing? I'm doing good, too. Yeah, are you Italiano? Uh, a little bit. A little bit? A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't it really little Richard that started rock and roll? You know, after this Elvis stamp, everybody just has their own little pet that they want to have a stamp now. I think it was Wayne Newton. Wasn't it really Wayne Newton that started rock and roll? <laughs> This weekend, you did? Did you did you ever go to one of those bars where they let you get up and sing songs in front of everybody? Yeah, you mean kara karaoke. That's it. That's it. Karaoke is okay. My yeah. friends my friends told me all about it. They told me, my friends would tell me, Ned, get up and sing a song for everybody. It wasn't the easiest thing to do either. Yeah. Especially with the guys in the band continually trying to push me off the stage. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there was a band? Yes, a very rude band. Oh. They would, they would hardly let me sing any of the songs. Just I an see. unbelievably rude karaoke, karaoke band. Ned, I don't think that was karaoke that was actually going on at the bar. But anyways, I got some tapes of just the instruments of some of my favorite songs now. Oh, really? You mean like the backing tracks that you can sing along to? Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've recorded, I've recorded my first song ever now. Really? You recorded a song? Well, that's pretty yes, nifty. it's a Thanksgiving song. Thanksgiving. To help remind my Aunt Ida not to make those very gross instant mashed potatoes when I go over to her house for Thanksgiving dinner this year. Really? Okay. I can't stand those instant mashed potatoes. Potatoes. No, you I know can't those either. those flakes that come in a box? Yeah, they're pretty bad. I've had them before. Mm, they should put a warning on the box. Yeah. Going, warning, warning. Yeah. Could be hazardous to your Thanksgiving dinner enjoyment. <laughs> so I made the song. Yeah. Let everybody know how much I hate them. I saw the box, but didn't think she'd have the nerve to serve those flakes. I had forgot why I... Here any other time of year. Oh no, oh no, oh no, not the house. Hurry, 
hurry, come one, come all to the new Hannah Park. Coming soon to beautiful downtown Utica. It's a patch. It's a patch. And Hannah told me about it. Where is it? It's so tiny. It's a patch. It's going to be your favorite attraction to downtown Utica. Hannah Land! It's the new Hannah Park with 32 pizza stands, all named Tony's. Don't forget about the 50-cent hot dogs, just like the old days with salt potatoes. Coming this summer to a small patch of land in downtown Utica. Ed Hannah told me about it. It's a patch. It's a patch. You can fly a flag on it. Yes, it's just a little patch of land, but certainly big enough to hold the all-new super colossal Hannah Park. This year, give the gift from the makers of America's favorite gift, the Chia Pet. Chia. Now, give the gift every chest hairless man will want to find under his tree, the new Chia Chest. Chia. Yes, it's new Chia Chest. Hair like you wouldn't believe. Just spread the special Chia growth formula on. Add a little water. And whoa, stand back and enjoy the fun as thick sprouts of chia chest hair begin to appear. Ooh, I just love a man with a hairy chest. A chia chest. Cheer up, unhairy gentlemen. Now try our chia plan. You'll be amazed. The chia chest will make you such a man. Bill here with Jeff and family at the popular vacation. A-S-O-C-K-S. It's easy to speak Spanish. Really? What do you wear on your feet? Socks. Can you spell socks? S-O-C-K-S. You just said, that's what I want. In Spanish? S-O-C-K-S. You can learn Spanish and five other languages with the patented National Speed Tapes program. Now, can you spell pantyhose? P-A-N-T-Y-H-O-S-E. Do you know what that means in Portuguese? No. You just said, stuff that trout down my pants, please. <laughs> wow, Portuguese is easy. If learning a language is what you want, just dial 1-800-555-1992 to enroll in the National Speed Tapes program. Can I learn Russian? Can you spell Russian? Sure, R-U-S-S-I-A-N. You just said my pet goose ate three elm trees today. In Russian? No, in Samoan. Give me a break. Can you spell break? B-R-E-A-K. You just said... Oh, shut up. That's ridiculous. Can you spell ridiculous? With Carr and Duke and Bunker. Oh, boy.